What's going on guys? Welcome back to another New World Guide. In this guide, I'm going to show you how I've been making a ton of gold in Season 3. Now if you see down here, I have 172,000 gold. And if you see in my company right here, I have 248,000 gold. Now I actually had over a million gold. I have spent quite a lot in the last few days. And I have kind of stopped making gold and I've been focusing on other things like actually building out my gear and my builds and min-maxing my character. So what I wanted to do is share two of the ways that I've been making my gold, and this has been making me the most gold, and it's still making good gold right now. It's not the boring farming or anything like that. So let's get into this. My last videos about making gold a few years ago was more about farming and, you know, getting, um, like, the ores and trees and all that sort of stuff, but that's not what this is about. So I'm going to show you two things, and I'll show you the first one. This is what's been making me the most gold. And you can actually see uh, a bit of a hint in the bottom there. I have a specific food that I've eaten. That's I've actually just been doing this. I just finished making a couple of these just to put on the marketplace. All right, so if we scroll to here and it says Mithril Ring. Now, this is actually a bug. They were supposed to fix it in today's update, but they didn't. This is actually um, an earring. Now, the thing with the earrings, so what you want to do is you want to do the one where you need a golden scarab and a chromatic seal. You don't want to do the one where you need um, this one. Uh, I, can't, I can't remember the one where you can choose three perks. You want to do the one where you can choose two perks. And what you want to do, you can choose, uh, you can craft 700 gear score, which is what you're going to want to do. And you can choose two specific craft mods. So for example, I would usually do the refreshing and refreshing toast. Now I don't have um, refreshing on me, so I'll pick this one. Now the reason why I have been choosing the uh, earring is because the earring has such a small pool of craft mods. So it's a very high chance for the third one, you're going to get the one that you want. And usually I get things like um, nimble or I'll get um, healing heart or I'll get like fortifying toast. I don't I never, oh actually, I've never actually gotten like Weapon Mastery or Cookie Mastery. And I've been able to sell these for insane profits on the marketplace. But between about 100,000 and 120. And now I'm selling them for around about 60,000 because the market has come down a little bit. But if we, for example, go up to say the uh, amulet, you'll see that the perk table is much bigger. So there is a less chance of getting a good third perk because there's more for it to actually roll. And the same with the um, the rings. This is actually, it says it's an earring, but it's actually a ring. The perk table is much bigger. So you have a less chance of rolling a really good roll on the two perks. But this is what I, this is one of the main ways I've been using to make gold. So what I, essentially, to sum it up, I've been rolling 700 gear score earrings and I've been choosing two perks and I've been choosing refreshing toast and I've been choosing um, refreshing. So you'll need a brilliant um, animus and you'll also need some high quality um, tallow. And then usually I, I will roll on the third one randomly empowering toast, healing heart or nimble. These are the three that I've been rolling for the third perk. I've never rolled anything else. Or regenerating is a good one. So this is actually um, one of the ones that I rolled here. I kept it on myself. Uh, this earring right here. Uh, sorry, this ring right here. Um, so it's it's actually an earring, but its ring is the actually shows it as a um, ring, and it is refreshing, refreshing toast and regenerating. Actually, is it? Oh yeah. See, yeah. So it's an earring. So it's around the wrong way. I actually I didn't realize I have it, have it equipped. So that's the thing, guys. You want to um, craft the earrings and you want to do refreshing and refreshing toast as your chosen perks. And then the third perk is usually going to um, roll a very good perk because the perk pool is so small on the earrings and you can sell them for very good gold. So that's one of the ways I've been making really good gold. The second way that I have been making gold and I am I do apologize, you will need 250 weapon smithing for this as well but hey if you're going to make good gold you do need to put the work in and that is what we call a weapon matrix so i've been crafting these um let's just find it here so i've been crafting these weapon matrixes and all you need is a tempered cast which you can buy from the marketplace and an enchanted handle now an enchanted handle i think you make in the armory if i remember correctly handle 
Yep. So you make these um, in here, and they're not actually very expensive. So these are about five hundred a piece, five uh, four hundred and four hundred. My services to say five hundred, to say three thousand dollars in materials just here, and then you need a gypsum orb and some Azoth. Um, and these are selling right now on my um, server. They might have gone down a little bit, but we'll have a look. Um, actually, they've gone up. So they were 7,000 yesterday. They are now 9,800. And if I go and do a cast, tempered cast here, they're only 2,400. So there is, you could essentially double your money. I'm actually going to buy one and I'm going to actually do that again because there is good gold to make in that. And I can, and what I'll do is I'll actually show you right now. Let's just do it. On this video i actually already had a tempered cast but um we're gonna make a handle enchanted handle we're gonna make that right now we're gonna make one enchanted handle so these are about 500 so it's about three thousand for me to make the handle just paid two thousand for the enchanted uh tempered cast i think i just paid uh two thousand or something like that we'll say three thousand so we'll say th uh, we'll say six thousand right so it's going to cost me 6,000 to make this weapon matrix. There we go. Craft. And I can sell it for nine. So $3,000 profit, which is not too bad. And you can actually pick up the tempered cast in the game as well and other means. And I'm going to go and uh, sell that. I'll just go um, here, weapon matrix or matrix. And you can do jewelry matrices, armor ones and stuff like that. So 9,800, I'm going to go and sell that right now. And I'll make around about 3,000 gold. Not a huge profit, but it's still uh, good gold. It's still a profit. And it's, it's just going to depend on the gypsum orbs that you get. Or you could do like a, um, there's other ones like an armor matrix. That's 6,000. And you can also do a uh, jewelry matrix uh, matrix as well which is ten thousand right now which is very very good so you can just go and see maybe this one would be worth doing instead but i would highly recommend doing the airing trick because it's working very well for me i'm still making money with that not as much as i was but i would highly recommend you get on that quick and that guys is how i have made over well, up to a million actually probably way more than a million because i've been spending a lot of it in new world don't forget to subscribe tap that notification bell and smash that like button for more gold making tips that i'll bring out soon because there has been some other ways that i've been making gold as well i'll see you then